Hi guys, welcome to our new video. Today we're going to show you how to connect your uh, Xiaomi. Xiaomi, Z, they call it Xiaomi um, router. I want to make it as an extender, Wi-Fi extender. So what I need, I need this cable to go to the laptop to set up. So I need the cable on the wall. Where's the cable on the wall? So that which comes from, um, I've got a 5G. So... Okay, okay. No, 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 don't do that. You're gonna, you're gonna make, mess it up. Let me get it. Let me get it. Let me get it for you. So, you press this. You press. You see? Come see? You press, you press, press. It comes out free. Okay. So, we're very far away from what we want. So, this guy ran the cable like this. It's gonna be not that much of a problem, but it's fine. So, yeah. I'm gonna remove it. But it has to sit here. Yeah. Okay, it's gonna remove it for me. So I can pull it this side. Okay, guys, I'm setting up. Okay, I wanna put it here. Okay, it's gonna sit here. You're gonna have to extend it. So anyway, guys, we wanna come on to. You can log into your laptop. He's gonna log into his laptop. No, even if, but the computer is working. Yes. Okay, I don't need a computer. I don't need a laptop. I'm gonna use a computer. Okay, this is the modem, the router. So the best thing I'm gonna do for myself, we're gonna unbox it. Uh, yeah, yeah, it's gonna open. Okay. Super simple. Wow, that's good. That's the way it looks like. This is our router. Okay, then we have our uh, adapter here. Okay. Um, the first thing to do is to connect it to power, which is doing for me. So. Okay, good. So, once we connect it to power, what do we need next? We get our cable, this one. We're going to run it to the PC. So, we connect this cable. Okay. Okay. Then, I'm going to put it to the into the PC. Okay. Then, I have another cable, which is going to give it internet. So, this cable starts from come from the router yeah connected it okay so now i'm gonna put this here we we'll put it here on the on the blue you can see the blue okay blue. what here okay once it's ticked in like tick so once it's done then we find so now we're asking the, the, the what the the pc should show something so you see automatically it's gonna open like this once it's open like that, it's going to tell you to, call, to select the country. You don't do that. You just say, yeah, you do that. Um, okay. And that, okay. Then you say, click here to select. You click there. Um, after, you go to... You can select any country. I'm going to select Morocco because my country is not here. So then I say next. We didn't say South Africa. So after saying next, sometimes... When you say try, it can give you some troubles. So what do we do? We can go to the... Sometimes it comes, like now it's going to come. I was going to give you a different uh, thing. So you can say click here to continue. Say click here. I'm clicking. Sometimes it's a bit slow. So you can go down and say next. After that, you can see this. So I'm going to change that. Oh, so... This Wi-Fi, I'm going to change it. Okay, sorry. Then I'm going to delete this. I'm going to give it what I want to give it. Um, I'm going to call it David. Okay. As I call it David, but it, it could be. Yeah, David. Um, City. Okay. And then when I'm there, can you give me your number? Zero six two. I'm gonna use his Seven number. Seven ninety one. Six zero. Six zero. Eight six. Eight six. So I'm using his number as the password. Uh, 
I'm getting disturbance here. So, okay, that's the password. Then I'm gonna say okay. Then I say, come on, I'm gonna copy this code. I might need it later. When you're on this page, you say next and say save, save, turn on save. Okay, when you're here. You come say okay david city and all that we can see the default gateway this is what we need now so to log in you're gonna use this uh so can i go get chrome so what we wanna do we wanna change also the the what the default gateway login that so it wants us to sign in chrome is giving us trouble here Okay, so what do I, I'm gonna do? Then I go to that and say one ninety two dot one six eight dot this can be dot thirty one dot dot what dot one. So once you're there, you say enter. Once we enter. You can be here then they ask you the password i'm gonna paste the same password we used we set up then say next should log in once it logs in here so what you're gonna do you're gonna look into this everything is fine quite fine so what i'm gonna do now you can see we have internet already it's connected but then what i need is i want to go to settings I'm going to do something very, very important for you guys because we don't want to conflict the conflict between the IPs. You can see if we go to network settings, you can see we're going to be having um, the IP address here, which is for the our router, the common gateway, not this router, but the where we're getting internet from. So I want to be a little bit um, different. I uh, want to make things to be different, uh, like what we say. Um, let me go see here. Wi-Fi setting, that one we find. LAN settings, we go there. Click that. Say, okay. You can see this. I want to make this to be not default because I'm gonna connect a lot of routers like this. So they have, if they have the same IP on the network, they're gonna be conflict on the network. So I'm gonna change that to be from 31 to 41. So from 41, also I'm going to give this to be 200. Once I make it 200, it will mean it's going to be unique. So there won't be no conflict in IP. So once I save and say, OK, restart, it's going to be 41, 200. So the router going to switch off itself. Then it will reboot. To show you look it's gonna go off when you see that there's no network there you just know that it rebooted so it's gonna come back here switch on itself you don't have to do anything absolutely nothing and we're about to finish guys don't worry that was the last step only so it comes back blue here you just know also here we're gonna have internet okay well that's it so once you see the internet then you know that you're fine you can see even the router went straight to show that common gateway now we have the the new ip address we have for the router it's no more the one you know so we can go to any website we want we can go to youtube and see youtube is working so well guys that's it thanks for watching and see you in the next video don't forget to subscribe